So now we're looking at the knee slice from the headquarters, all right? And like Liv said earlier, I do need to have balance in here. I need to be mobile as well, all right? So what I'm gonna do now is, instead of having my hand on the outside for the X-bars, I'm gonna have it on the inside. With this collar grip, I'm gonna anchor myself in, and then I'm gonna shove Liv's knee to the ground while I sidestep to here, all right? It's really important at this stage that I keep my hips close to hers, right? I wanna be using my left foot to drive into her to always keep her flat, all right? She'll probably frame off this. What I'm gonna do now is I, I catch the tricep with the elbow, I put my knee to the ground. I upgrade this to an underhook and I slide my head next to her head. All right, this is where it gets a little bit tricky, all right? I'm gonna use my left foot to drive in. I'm gonna use my knee as a pivot to slide her legs that way and make her hips completely face away from me. Then I can establish a good side control. After the side step, and I keep this space in here, it's important that when I pull on Liv's arm as I switch the underhook, that my head is on the same side as my legs, all right? If my head's on this side, there is a chance that she can overhook my arm and bridge me right over. And all my hard work has failed. Another detail is when I'm here, and I get into my positions here, once my knee's on the ground, I'm not sliding my leg this way, because this creates too much space, all right? Instead, what I'm doing is, my aim is to throw her legs to the other side, and how do I do that? So I attach myself, come in nice and close, my head goes down and my knee goes to the ground. Super important, my knee goes to the ground. I use my left foot to drive into Livia, and I slide my knee backwards, my, and my foot faces the ceiling just momentarily, Establish side control.